Hi, it's Heather from Heather's Michigan Garden, and my husband and I decided to make a trip over to Lowe's to check out the bulbs uh, they just got in. And there's a couple that I'm really interested in. One of them that I would like to plant this year are the gladiolas. Um, I like the mixed colors on this one. Um, and I also like the pinks and purples on the berry mixed gladiolas. And this one is just a mixed color. But there's 25 bulbs in each bag, and they're what, nine, is that 995? Yep, 998. 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 8 um, each bag. So I'm gonna pick these up. And then. I also found these coral colored peonies and I know it might take like three years before these bloom um, but I wanted to try one of the coral and uh, that's $6.98 and there's just one in here so we'll grab one of those. Um, what else? Let's see. Oh. And then they have um, this Sarah Barnhart peony um, that I'm gonna pick up also. Grab one of those. And they have the Leatris. And I really like the pinks and whites. So you'll notice that in my garden, I have a lot of those colors. So I'm gonna grab that. Actually, I'm gonna grab this bag. Can you help me hold this open? My hands are getting full. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna throw these in my bag that I brought. It's super cute. Isn't that adorable? And then there's a couple other things that I wanted to get while I was here. <clears throat> um, another thing that I wanna add into my garden that I don't have right now are irises. Um, I had these in our garden when I was a child at home uh, growing up and I always loved them a lot and I don't have any in my garden. So I wanted to um, grab some uh, irises to put in the garden. I'm gonna grab that. And let's see, anything else? They have a box of cone flowers also that I think I'm gonna grab because I love my cone flowers um, so I'll grab one of these to see how this works out in the garden this year and let's see is there anything Jose that you were looking at that you would like oh, those are really cool blue hostas <laughs> but we don't have a place for those and I do want the giant 12 foot sunflowers. Mm -hmm. I tried to sneak those in our bag last time and I got caught. <laughs> They're too hard to pick, I think. They're just too tall. We may, we may opinion, have but... some surprise growth. Stay tuned. Yeah. <laughs> one of the things I do like are the oriental lilies. I don't know if this one. One's, so it's a mixed. Trying to figure out which ones are in this because my favorite is the stargazer lily but i also have the tiger lily i can't tell which ones are in here and i decided to get dressed up in a cute little dress to go flower shopping to get into the season um for this year so excited i don't know i kind of like this one too around the the dog pen because it looks like it's got some peach and red which we have around the, the dog pen i think that would look really pretty also what do you think absolutely yeah yeah i think i might grab this one also oh, oh my goodness my bag is full <laughs> So anyway, this is what we are doing. All the bulbs seem to be in the stores now. 
and um, um, we have a beautiful day out today. It's going to be in the 50s in Michigan today and the 60s tomorrow. So we're going to be doing some more yard cleanup and um, just like cutting, like deadheading my hydrangeas this weekend and just doing some more flower bed cleanup. So anyway, I hope you're having a wonderful weekend and out looking for bulbs to plant in your garden. Have a great day and thanks for watching Heather's Michigan Garden.